Hey there guys, it's Delta here with a tutorial on how to install the Optifine mod for Minecraft 1.9. The first thing you want to do is open up your Minecraft launcher. Once it loads up, using any profile, click the Edit Profile button. And under Use Version, select Release 1.9 and click Save Profile. Then click Play, and this will download all of the 1.9 libraries if you do not already have them. And once you reach the main menu, you can click Quit Game. Now you want to open up your web browser and navigate to optifine.net slash downloads, which is linked in the description. And because there are only preview versions right now, for Minecraft 1.9, you want to click the preview versions link. In the future, there will be a title that says Minecraft 1.9, and then you would just click download. When you reach the ad fly page, wait for the skip ad button to appear in the top right and click skip ad. And then in the middle of the three ads, there is another link. You want to click that and save the Optifine jar file on your desktop. Then go ahead and navigate to your desktop and you want to right click the Optifine jar file, click open with and select Java Platform SE Binary. When the installer dialog comes up, you want to click Install, and then click OK. And now let's go ahead and go into Minecraft, and make sure the Optifine profile is selected, and click Play. Once it loads up, go ahead and go into a single player world. And if you hit F3, you can see that in the top left, it says, Minecraft 1.9 and it says 1.9 dash Optifine. That means Optifine is installed and you should have extra video settings here in the video settings menu. Also, if you're interested, the zoom key is by default the C key. So if you'd like to zoom, you can do that using the C key. And that is it for this tutorial. If you did find this helpful, a like and a share would be greatly appreciated. If you're not already subscribed, make sure you do so for more gaming tutorials and reviews. If you have any questions, you can leave those in the comments below and I will do my best to answer them. And if you're not following me on Twitter, a link to my Twitter page is down in the description below as well as other social links. And you can follow me there for updates and also interesting tidbits from the internet. Thanks for watching and have a good one.